And what's good, YouTube? This your boy, Coach Dante, in the building with you guys, man. Please comment, like, and subscribe on this video, man. I really thank you guys for showing love to the channel for the two preseason games I did today. I really uh, thank you guys for showing love uh, uh, every single day, regardless of what live stream I'm doing, regardless of what play-by-plays I'm doing. I just really appreciate the love. Uh, shout out to the, all of Texas Nation. Shout out to you guys. You guys was amazing tonight. Uh, I really appreciate you guys. Uh, let's get right into the video, man. Uh, the Houston Texans beat the New Orleans Saints 17-13. Uh, to 13. Uh, Very good performance by a lot of guys, you know, that's trying to make this football team. You know, I don't take this. You know, every win is a good win. We want to see you guys. Go out there. And you want to see you guys go out there, and you want to do well. You want to see who's going to impress you the most to make this football team. But shout out to the New Orleans Saints fan base as well, man. That's a great team that they got over there. Very stingy defense they got over there. And I expect, like I said, I got them uh, in the playoffs in a wild card spot this year. That's a very good team that they got over there. So big shout out to the Saints fans. Uh, much love, much respect. Like I say, again, preseason. Uh, just want to see. I didn't care if we lost the game or not. I just wanted to, like I say, see uh, what guys are going to impress. And there were some guys out there that was impressive tonight. Um, Thomas Booker got a sack tonight. Got a sack tonight. Very good in the run game and in the passing game. Showed some flashes. Showed me something. Uh, Jalen Camp, the catch in the back of the end zone, the good com concentration, and uh, the last drive of the game. Last drive of the game, when he turned number 37 around, Jalen Kemp can run routes. He can run past his defender. Uh, it's very good. Chris Moore, I thought, like I say, I think I got him from uh, wide receiver three. And the Texans didn't use Philip Dorsett that much. I don't think Philip Dorsett may, make, may not make the team. The way they're using him, uh, I don't think Philip Dorsett may make the team. He look like he's maybe on the cutting edge. Uh, Jalen Camp got an opportunity to compete, but I think he's going to be a practice squad player. But I like Jalen Camp. I thought he did a very, very good job tonight. Um, I like the Cashman. Cashman was really good, too, tonight. On every play, he was really good. Number 45, I don't know who his name is, but he got some pressures, got a sack tonight. Um, MJ Stewart. MJ Stewart was very good, man. He bust up a screenplay earlier in the game. Uh, got up underneath it, got up underneath the screen, and just uh, tackled. He made some pretty pretty big plays tonight, man. Damian Pierce, uh, Jalen Petrie was a steal of the show. It was the Texans player of the game, in my opinion, man. Uh, that's why they on this thumbnail, man. Jalen Petrie, man, was all over the place, man. Whatever the ball was, that's where he was. Um, he got a tackle and a loss. He got a tackle in the backfield for a loss. Uh, Jalen Petrie almost came up with that interception. He was right by the play with uh, Traquan Smith uh, caught that interception on a tip pass by uh, Ian Book. Uh, he was all over the place. Um, the defensive line could not stop the run, uh, could not stop the run on the first possession. Uh, the second, the third, fourth team was did very good against the run. First team, they didn't do good. Rasheen Green, all of those guys, you know, Lopez, they didn't do very good against the run. It was just a walking apart. Ross Blacklock it was just a walking apart tonight. Uh, that first drive of the game in a, against the run. Uh, Chris Moore really like him. Catch, get wide open. The catch across the middle. Oh, uh, using his hands, very solid. We had eleven penalties tonight. We got to clean up on those penalties as well. We had eleven penalties tonight, uncalls for. Uh, we forced three fumbles. Forced two fumbles. Uh, one by the goal line, which was uh, Davis. Davis knocked the ball out at the end zone. Uh, we end up getting the ball back. Ian Book uh, fumbled the ball, fumbled the ball, trying to catch the snap. Uh, we did catch an interception, which is Traquan Smith uh, caught on a tip pass. Uh, Thomas Booker also had a deflected pass, which deflected right back in Ian Book. And also, I think that was his sack that he got right there. But, again, a lot of guys that impressed, man. Uh, very impressed with Jalen Petrie and, you know, you know, uh, Thomas Booker tonight and also Damian Pierce, man. Damian Pierce, man. How about that? 
you know, my guys podcast, you know, shout out to Matthew Biggins and shout out to, you know, my boy Crenshaw and my boy B. I predicted that um, Damian Pierce is going to have a 20 yard run. And he did that last night. First play of the game, first, first run of the game for him, 20 yard scamper, 20 yard scamper. Uh, first play of the game. We saw the uh, go to the left side, the cut back inside. And he got another 17 yards out of that. Uh, he averaged 9.8 yards a pop tonight for, uh, you know, uh, Tom, Damian Pierce. I think he can handle the load of being a number one running back. Uh, but we'll see what happens. I don't care who starts at running back. Marlon Mack can start all I care. But Damian Pierce is going to be a very good, man. I can tell this guy's ready. This guy's very physical. Um and he can block. He can block as well, man. It was one play that a uh, defensive lineman came right across, was coming in. He just literally picked him up and just picked him up and almost threw him down. I mean, what a heck of a block that was by Damian Pierce as well, man. The guy's big. He's strong. Um, man, really like Damian Pierce, man. So it's a lot of guys that impressed me tonight, man. Jeff Jesco did not have a very solid game tonight, but he made the plays when he needed it to. Uh, the pass to uh, the pass to Jalen Camp again was very very solid in the back of the end zone. That was just a better catch by Jalen Camp. And also, man, also um, Johnny Johnson after the interception, after the drop pass on third down, he comes back with a um, he comes back with a vengeance catches a post corner route um, spin moves twice, get us down by the goal line, and then he finished it off with a touchdown on the post on a uh, post on a corner route going in the end zone. So good job by Johnny Johnson redeeming himself. Um, but it was a lot of good guys that impressed me. So that's the end of the video, man. Comment, like, and subscribe on what, what impressed you guys tonight. What players impressed you guys tonight? Christian Harris didn't get a, didn't get a uh, playing time tonight. Uh, Derek Stingley didn't play. You should see some of them guys. Most of them guys, when we go against the Los Angeles Rams on Friday night, on this coming Friday night, man. But a lot of guys impressed me. Like I say, man, Jalen Petrie and Damian Pierce is the most standout guys. Uh, Thomas Booker was very, very good, man. Tonight, Jalen Camp, you know, Chris Moore. I mean, you had MJ Stewart. MJ Stewart was good, man. Uh, like I say, man, a lot of guys that impressed me tonight. Uh, those are the guys that impressed me the most, though. But comment, like, and subscribe. Texans fans are what you guys think. Uh, of this uh game tonight and what guys impressed you guys tonight so comment like and subscribe man thank you guys i'm out much love peace go texans